Okay, gonna do some uniform acceleration questions. Uh, the first one I typed up, we'll just tackle them in order, obviously. Um, the key is gonna be read through them, find the three numbers in the question mark, figure out what equation goes with that, and then solve it. So for those, so when we start reading it, a ball is at rest at the top of a hill. At rest is a keyword in physics. Uh, since it's saying it started at rest, that's really telling us the V1. So I know the V1 is zero. It says it accelerates at a rate of two meters per second. From the units, from the grammar, I can tell that that's the acceleration two. And it's got those uh, interesting units of meters per second squared. That happens for three seconds. That's my time. And then finally, how far does it go? So what this question is asking for is the displacement. If we take a look at that, sort of look through that, um, as I first go through, I would look for what's missing. There's no V2. Not that it didn't have a second speed. I just don't care about the second speed. I know what started from rest. I know it's acceleration. I know the time. I want to know how far. I just don't care about how fast it's going at the end. In this case, so knowing that there's no V2, now we look for the equations. The equation without V2 is that 1 half a t squared equation. I don't have to rearrange it. I can just plug in numbers. Uh, the first term is 0 times 3, so that turns into a 0 plus 1 half of 2 times 3 squared. I can do that in my head. 1 half of 2 is 1. 3 squared is 9. So my answer here is 9 meters. This object moved 9 meters while accelerating. 